Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here for Raptor's Game and Goodies. Hey, if you love Gold Rush, if you love gold and getting rich, well, look no further. The Dino Miner box is here. A truckload of goodies is coming your way. T-shirts and equipment, much more in that Dino Miner box. Check it out down below in the description to get all sorts of different equipment to mine gold in your backyard. Yes, the Dino Miner box. You can drill, you can dig, and you can learn a lot more about gold. All that heavy equipment inside that box is waiting for you. So check it out with that Dino Miner box. Check down below in the description and much more coming soon. Oh my God, get rich quick, baby. Yeah, go digging in your own backyard. Have fun. Hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome back to Farmer's Dynasty. Today we're wrapping up the uh, grain harvest of wheat. We're going to go deliver that to town, make some money, see if we can pick up that hay baler. I hear from you guys that hay bales are super, super expensive and make a lot of good money. So if you have any more tips for me, go ahead and let me know down below in the comments section. And if you'd like to see more of this series, heck, let's get it up to 1,000 likes. Everybody watching right now, hit that button and look at those likes grow as we're trying to find true love here in today's uh, series i guess we're trying to uh, get rich here and i hear that as i said grain uh wheat bales uh, from hay and straw and such make a lot of good money uh from all of that i, I think you i wonder if you can uh, sell hay and straw and different things for sure you can definitely sell bales i don't know if it's uh, wheat and uh, i don't know if you can even feed cows but we have yet to figure that out i'd like to get some animals asap we're almost full on our harvester here and you guys told me that you can right click to look at uh, how full things are how uh, full of fuel that kind of thing so one thing i learned earlier too is that we can't mix our silos uh, grains in our silos so we actually have to sell our grain here today so we're going to go ahead and do that asap as soon as we get everything full up here so thanks again as always for your tips your support everything all right wow we were just like driving all around this place all that wonderful wonderful Material on the ground will be bailed up and is going to make... Oh, this is basically gold and gold is basically what it is. It's gold and money. Look at that. Beautiful. All right, let's get over to the uh, over to the harvester or the, the uh, grain cart with the harvester. Things are looking good so far. So, like I said, we need to deliver this somewhere else. You guys told me that somewhere on the map in the south, there is a better place to sell all your grain. So we will uh, see if we can do that. We're going to skirt skirt right up to our uh, trailer here. Hopefully we can get it inside. Looks like it's yep. Looks like it's going in. It's hard to tell sometimes with this thing whether or not it's going into the trailer. I always get nervous that we're going to spill some. But anyway, uh, we just need to get this full. I'm a little bit more concerned with not just the grain, but actually getting all of the uh, hay and straw and all the other stuff uh, harvested here. It's going to be really awesome. I wonder if we can make uh, grass bales too and dry them out to make uh, hay like that. That would be really cool because I know we can mow the lawn. And if we're going to pick up a baler, we might be able to do both. So you'll just have to let me know. Otherwise, I'll have to find out on my own. All right, this should be our uh, second to last pass here. We're coming in for the final kill on this field. One or two passes more. How full are we? About 19%. We should be able to get the rest of the job done, I hope, before we're done here. Let's see here. I missed a few minor spots. I'm doing a lot better than I do in farming sim. That is for sure. I really wish this game was multiplayer, too. I need, I need a friend. But don't worry, we'll, we'll wipe up somebody very soon and uh, see if we can get them to work on the farm. And then have kids and then uh, get them to work on the farm too. Perfect reason to have kids. All right, we're at, uh, what, let's see, 41%. I was trying to read that number. Hard to see that sometimes. We're at 40% there. Just missed a little bit of the weed. I'm not going to be too picky about it. Uh, we'll just swing back to get a little bit more over here, and then we are good. All right, that's the weed harvest out of the way. We're just going to drop it off then, circle back. And we should be good to go. In fact, you know what I'm going to do is I'm just going to bring the harvester over to the edge of the field and we'll bring the grain cart over. So let's bring that over right away. So this is it for the fields that we own. I'm going to park this thing over here by the barn. I got an idea. We're going to park this thing inside. So let's come to a stop. All right, there we go. Let's get off this thing. Oh, I always have my scaffolding out every time. Here, put that away. Sorry, I was busy. We need to get some food, too, which means we need cash, which is why we're working on the bales. Oh, there's our uh, our mowing blade. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to push that out of the way with the harvester. All right, uh, so one thing you guys told me is if we go to this, we can click on that. Wonderful. Great teleport mode. Thank you, guys, for all your tips. You guys are fantastic. Making things a little bit easier for Farmer Raptor. Now, unfortunately, we don't have a full... Uh, uh, grain cart yet. I don't think we will, but we'll come pretty close. Love the putt-putt of this truck. Alright, let's see how much money we make from it. Let's get in there with putt-putt. 
Mm, oh, what? Oh, we bumped the door? Really? Look at the hitbox on that door. Are you kidding me? Or is that the tree? Is that the door or the tree? Oh, what? Oh, that's such a big hitbox for no reason. I could have totally squeezed in there. All right, let's shut the door. There we go. Yeah, we could have totally squeezed past the harvester. And right there is good. Look at how beautiful this looks. This game is so, so, so gorgeous. All right, out with the grain. And in with the money. Perfect. All right, we're all done with the grain uh, harvester now. So let's go ahead and back the cart out of the way. I wonder if we should mow the lawn. That's something we can do, right? All right, let's park over here for now. We're going to park this thing inside. All right, I'm going to head on the road now and see if we can find where to sell some of this stuff. So uh, don't mind me. We're going to park this thing. I'll see you guys on the road. All right, we're almost there. We just got to get on this main road here, and we are to the mill. So just so you know, I did spill some of the grain at some point, and also I tried to put some of it in the silo, and apparently it's not supposed to mix, so we did lose some of that. So I probably won't have as much cash as I should, but don't worry. What I hear about the bales is that we get tons of money, and money is going to be very important here at the start more than, uh, I guess, well, from the bales. I don't think we're going to get a lot of money from the grain, but at least we can buy enough uh, food to get us started. I think all I have left is like condensed milk in my inventory, so that's uh, pretty that's pretty sad. Wow, look at this. I wish there was some trap. Ooh, this is beautiful. Wow. It's actually more gorgeous up here than I thought it would be. All right, we're almost to our uh, mill now. Where is it? Oh, it's up there on the... Oh, cool, up on the right side. Oh, is that a dock over there? Nice, I see a fishing dock. Um, actually, a few of them. I wonder if there's any jobs we can do for uh, farmers or anything, or uh, fishermen, I mean. What's that up there? Is that like, uh, what is that, like, uh, Stonehenge or something? Anyway, all right, time to get up this hill. Oh, man, I love the dock. Love the free camera, too. Can we go any faster than this thing? Geez, only, only downhill, we can only do 23. We need to supercharge turbo this thing. We need like a Hemi, a supercharger, turbo, jet engine, rocket, all working together on this thing to get her up to 24 kilometers an hour. Look at that mill, man. That's impressive. All right, let's get up to the top. All right, time to begin the climb. We'll see how much cash we make. It's actually a very long drive down here. We, we need a faster tractor and a bigger trailer in order to really make this thing shine. Okay, we have 74%, so that's uh, 3,000. I think we get... Uh, 500 a ton. So is is a thousand kilograms a metric ton? I'm not I'm not sure of that is that three tons. Oh wow, we're really going slow up here. Come on, baby, climb. So we should have had like a one and a half full wheat grain carts, or maybe actually two out of that, which is a very so quite a bit for the uh, small field that we had. You notice the old mill on the hill? Perhaps it'd be nice to talk to the owners. Yeah. Oh, we got to do a quest here now too. Oh God. We also have to get that baler. Oh, wow, this is a nice field. All right, here we come. The road is really beautiful. All right, let's see where the owners are at. Uh, where would we even park this thing? Oh, right there. Okay, I see where we can park. Does this thing even need a parking brake? Oh, no. Okay. How come every time I do this, the scaffolding's out? Okay, hi there. Hello. We'll talk later. What do you mean we'll talk later? Don't we have enough social points? Maybe maybe this woman. Hello, there we my go. name's Sybil. And who might you be? Raptor? You might know me. I live on the farm nearby. Oh. Saw this mill from afar. Just wondering if it's still working. Well, barely. We try to make eco flour and sell it to bakeries. Hippies. But farmers prefer to sell grains elsewhere. We even raised prices as much as we could afford it, but still not many people visit us. I'm down. So you say I can sell you my grains for a better price? Yes, at least for a time being. And remember, we take wheat and barley only. Oh darn, okay, I can't sell canola here. It's good to know. I'll keep that in mind. Alright, we got our first deal. Well, hope to see you soon. Yeah, I'm uh, actually right, right now. I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Oh, and I got 500 social points just for chatting. What's up, neighbor? We got ourselves some grains. All right. So let's make our first delivery. Let's see how much cash we get. Tractor is 61% full. Man, I've been driving this thing around a lot. All right. Let's see how much cash we make. And this should be good, right? 
Whoa, what the? Wow, we're making a ton of cash. Oh my goodness. Oh no, I wish I hadn't dropped so much now. We could have made like 4,000 euros out of that if I wouldn't have been so clumsy. But that's all right. Lesson learned. That's life. And we made a ton of good cash here. Very good. About like 1,600 euros. That's good. That's enough for food. I can, I can live now. I can live. Actually, we should buy some fields too. All right. So that's one of our next objectives. So uh, let's see. If we had more money, I could probably buy a field or something like that and get harvesting. Because like right now, isn't it like August or something like that? What What's the year? Or the uh, month. I don't know. All right, let's get back to the house, and uh, we're going to start on going to our next quest, which is to grab the uh, bale trailer. So let's do that next. I feel like we've been driving all day. We kind of have, actually. Okay, almost there. So we're picking up this baler now. It's going to be a minute or two. wonder what this next quest is. Um, the baler... Oh boy, I bet it's repairing a barn again. Oh god. Oh god. Let's see, how do we... Do we go down this road? Uh, meet Kelvin. Uh, is that Kelvin there? Why do I have... I have this out every time. It's like I want to just do immediate scaffolding. All right, let's talk to this guy. I don't know if this is him. Oops. Kelvin, is that you? I don't want to walk in your field. Sir? Talk later. Okay, we'll talk later. All right, it was the wrong guy. Maybe Kelvin's over here. Oh, I bet we have to do barn repair. Oh, hi. Not now. So really? Are you do in a leather jacket? Really? Wow. She's doing some heavy labor in a leather jacket. All right. This is the wrong house, but maybe we can come back here later. I don't know what we can do here, but uh, let's go to the next house. Next one down. My bad. GPS was off a little bit. I wonder if we can buy this field. This looks like the perfect field right here. All right. Kelvin, we're looking for you, bro. Oh, there it is. Is that the baler? And we already have the hay bale wagon. Oh, look at this thing. Hold on. Let's Before we talk to him, let's take a look at it. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. It makes square bales. Very nice. So it picks it all up here, pushes it into a square bale, and drops it out the backside. Nice. <laughs> Um, are you going to say anything? Hello, need anything? Well, yes. Is that Baylor available? Wow, that hat on that guy. Something like that. Now, what the hell? I'm leaving this place anyway. Oh, you're so, leaving? You know, oh, goodbye. I'm moving back to the sea. <laughs> Guess this life's not for a sailor. That guy's hat is so weird. So, how much money do you have? Oh, wow. Well, not much. At least not for such old equipment. But I do work. If you say so, I guess if you restore these barns, I'll oh. get more money selling the farm. So, I'm good anyway. What do you think? Uh, yeah. You've got yourself a deal. Okay. All right, well, typical thing. You guys know the drill by now. Some farm maintenance. Not too bad. What do we need to repair exactly? Oops. Uh, all right, the barn. And that's it. Just the two barns. Okay, so we already know what needs to be done here. We've done this a million times before. I thought we were... Uh, somebody said, like, you have to ask somebody out on a date or something like that, which is going to be pretty easy, actually, if you just have to ask somebody out on a date for someone else. Then maybe that's uh, for the manure spreader or something like that. I don't know. Too bad this guy didn't uh, want to do the farm life, though. Um, I would imagine that this life and the life on the sea would pretty much be the same. Hard work, having to do maintenance, you know, having to you know work for your food, that kind of thing. Well, that actually looked like it was plastered up there. What is this? Just, like, paint? Oh, I see. Up here, old bricks. Okay, let's get this barn done, and uh, I will see you guys on the roof of the last barn. We got a lot of work to do here, so here we go. All right, I think I nailed it. Well, not yet, anyway. All right, we got to get up to the top of the scaffolding. You guys know the drill by now. Let's get this thing down and get up top. Perfect. All we got to do is get up there and uh, lock down a few extra sections of uh, wood onto the top panels, and we are good to go. That is it for the roof. Holy crap, there's some gaping holes in this roof. Oh my god, man. All right, we're going to get this thing filled in and grab that baler and head back then. I think the only things left to do are the manure uh, spreader and then also an old cedar. And I think we need to talk to somebody, like ask somebody out on a date for somebody else. I, I don't know. 
I'm still fancying the girl with the uh, the tomato farm, by the way. I think she like got a husband or something like that. But, you know, tragic accidents happen all the time on the farm. You never know when somebody might accidentally be repeated, uh, you know, backed over six times by a tractor uh, repeatedly. You know, accidents like that happen. They just happen. I liked enjo uh, I really enjoyed fixing up that other barn, by the way. That one is, uh, I think that reminds me of the uh, barn we have back at the house. So, all right, let's get over to this side. I think this is it right here. Um, just these, what, four, three, four panels, and we're good. Just two more to go. All right, there we go. On to the next one. I think we got this one in the bag. It never gets old to kind of repair stuff, I think. I really do enjoy it. Oh, it looks like there's a few more. I want there to be more than just barns to fix up, though. We fixed up chicken coops, barns, greenhouses, and homes. I wonder what else would you see on a farm? There was, of course, a vehicle storage thing. We did fix up our silo, too. It'd be nice if you could build stuff, though. I really want to build a fishing dock for no... Maybe just for decoration. That would be... I think that'd be really cool to be able to decorate our uh, farm with the fishing dock and maybe just have it increase the happiness or the mood of people. That'd be nice. Oh, wow, that, that is a huge hole in that barn. Some of these barns aren't even complete. Like, they're not just, like, rotted. They're just, like, not even complete. All right, yeah, look. Oh, what? That one, like, unfinished itself. Oh, jeez. All right, I have that happen sometimes. I think that's a glitch or something. I don't know. It looked done. It's going to be done now. Going to learn today. This should be the last shot. Nope. Oh, wait, there's, uh... Oh, there's repairs that need to be done on the sides, too, don't there? Or is it inside? Oh, maybe there's some repairs on the inside of the barn that need to be done. Hold on. Do we get the outside sections here? Oh, okay. We got to get up there. Let me put some scaffolding down for that. Well, at least we're done with the roof. Uh, let's go ahead and put it around like this. Oh, we're going to have to do that weird kitty corner jump again, aren't we? Uh, you know, actually, let me see if we can get inside the barn and uh, do this. Oh, wow. There's a lot of maintenance to do on the inside. Uh, I don't want to... Let's repair. There we go. Difference between repair and rebuild, too. We can upgrade if we do the rebuild, which is different. It should say upgrade instead of rebuild, because there's a difference between repairing and rebuilding. Ah, I see. Some of these posts need repair. Wow, that's going to take a lot of materials. Come on, baby. Do your thing. There we go. That one's done. All right, this wall here. What else do we need to repair? Looks like this support beam's over there by the door. All oh, these beams, too. That's what I'm talking about, getting up there. That's where we want to get up. If I can put some scaffolding down, we can get up there and repair that. Oh, that's all good. Okay. Oh, uh, this side needs repair, too. Okay, so this needs to be repaired. Then the one across the other side, I think. Or will this repair that? Oh, it did. Okay, it repaired the far one. All right, just a few more nails. Then the roof is all done. And we just need to get the top sections of the roof, and we are good. A little bit of brick laying. Gangsta's laying them bricks, y'all. All right, perfect. All done here. And it looks like everything's repaired on the inside of the barn, aside from the other sides of the barn. Okay, so let's get the scaffolding up. We've done this before. Should know what to do here. Can we throw that down? Oh, really? I've laid scaffolding inside the building before. Oh, darn it. All right. We'll just do it this way. Now let's go back to repair. And I think we can do it from here, but let's go up one more level. There we go. All right, perfect. So on the other barn, I was able to get inside the barn and build scaffolding on the inside to repair it, but I guess we can't do that here. Let's take these scaffolding down. Uh, take that one down. Do we have to be on the ground? I don't want to do that. Uh, let's go down. Be really cool if we could actually build stuff with scaffolding too, not just repair. God, I really want the ability to put down buildings. That would be so cool. All right, that's done. All right, let's get to the other side. And that should be a job well done. We will grab that uh, baler now. Uh, let's put our thing down over here. There we go. That one's better connected. All right, repair. And we should be able to reach it from here. Little kitty corner action, but we got her. That is another job well done. Boom. All right, perfect. Now we can check in with Kelvin and get out of here. That's my favorite temperature measurement, by the way. Give it up for Kelvin, y'all. Mm -hmm. You all know what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Kelvin, we're done. What's up, buddy? We're all finished. All you, done. you and your weird hat. It's like he's hiding an egg as under his head. You may take the bail. Good. I'm going to bail, bro. Thanks. See you around. Not for long, mate. Not for long. He said mate. You got to be kidding. I can already feel the breeze. Wow. This guy is like just zoning out already there, buddy. We are done here. Let's get out of here. Grab our bailer. And let's head home. All right. Watch out there, Calvin. I'm driving. Calvin, you're going to you're going to end up dead. Right, I'm going to just try to move around Kelvin a little bit. 
There we go. Thanks, Kelvin. Bye, brother. We are out of here. All right, perfect. Whew. All right, now, before we go any further, let's check our map. Sam, she's the one who needs to uh, have the cedar. Lydia's got the old fertilizer, and Frank's got the old uh, manure spreader. So it's still three things to do, but we can at least head back to the farm and start bailing. So I will see you guys back at the farm. Oh, man, it's getting dark. We better get home quick. Engage that turbo thruster. Now's the time where we need it. All right, we're pulling into the farm now. Man, it's gotten late real quick. I can't believe how quickly time uh, changes in this game, but uh, that's what happens when you're hard at work. Let's roll over here to the start of the hayfield. Or, oh, well, I guess we're going to... Uh-oh. Wait, really? Look at the hitbox on this thing. What are we even hitting? There's nothing there. Oh, that's lame. All right, we're going to come over here now and start uh, getting ready to bail. Okay, let's see what happens when we... Uh, Turn on, turn off harvester. Oh, it was on the whole time? Oh, that's funny. Well, let's see what happens here. Well, let's try it a little bit and see what happens when we do this. Oh, nice. I wonder if we can pick up the bales. Let's try to plop one out here and see what happens. Oh, there we go. Oh, wonderful. One just came out. Oh, a newborn little baby. <gasps> Perfect. We can pick these up and stack them on the uh, hay bale cart. Oh, this is fantastic. Where is that? All right, I'm going to drop one off here, and we're going to call it a day. There it is right over there. All right, everyone, if you guys have enjoyed what you've seen here today, again, remember to hit that like button, and I will go ahead and play much more of this game. So if you want to see more, hit the like button. We're going to go to market eventually with our hay bales and make a ton of money. i got to run to the grocery store. we got to make some more money to make up for me being a derp on the grain field. Uh, but that's it for now on our wheat harvest. So that's it. I'll see you all next time. I'm hitting the hay, quite literally. All right. <laughs> Bye, everyone.